and welcome to day 21, 22. 22nd day of Vlogmas. <laughs> I have just finished my second coffee. It was really good. And I am about to go on the hunt for my recipe book. I need to start cooking and baking today and the recipe book that I use mainly has not been unpacked. There must still be a kitchen or dining room box somewhere in this house and my aim is to find it today. Hmm. Let's hope I can do that. One thing I have done this morning though is added my contrast colour to my habitation throw and yesterday I wound up three of the next colourways so that I can start um, adding those in. So hopefully I can get to day nine today. I am loving this project. It is so addicting. It is so satisfying to see the stripes grow together. And I really am looking forward to having some time to work on it more, probably after Christmas realistically, but maybe sometime later today as well. My husband and my son have just headed out to the store. They're picking up a few bits and pieces. I may also need to head to the store at some point today. But we'll see how we go. Um, I'll try to take you along as I can. It might be just a pretty busy around the house kind of day. See if I can share some of my cooking and my baking with you as well. That's always fun to share. And uh, I hope you're having a lovely 22nd day of Vlogmas and December. And I will check back in with you again soon. We haven't been in this room yet. This is my study or lovingly known as Box City. And there are some, quite a few boxes in here still. One of which hopefully contains my recipe books. Yeah. Let's see if I can get this into some sense of order today. I don't think I'll unpack the whole room. I'm literally just looking for a very specific thing, but it might mean that I may unpack some things or move things into different parts of the house to make it easier to get to some of these boxes because there are a lot of them in here. <laughs> Wish me luck. has all of my handwritten recipes in it. So um, I have, for example, our favorite gingerbread recipe in here, which I use every year. Let's see if I can find it. We actually got this out of uh, one of the kids' magazines when they were little. It's Shag Shaggy and Scooby's gingerbread recipe. And I've made some little notes on there. And the other thing that I really need from here is my recipe for my salmon and potato pie. I just realized I'm really short here. And that's in here as well. So I'm so happy. <laughs> the first box I opened up, that was very serendipitous. Brilliant. So you know what that means. Not much else is happening in here today because <laughs> I found what I needed, which is brilliant. Very happy about that. Great outcome. So I have actually made a little bit of progress in here. I am still looking for the box with the wrapping paper and the sticky tape. But I think I've emptied about 10 boxes now. So I'm feeling like I'm making great progress. So that feels good. I've got another couple of boxes that I'll check and then I think I'll give up for today. We'll see how we go. I mentioned I had labeled it right. I found the box. Okay, wrapping paper done. Now sticky tape is still missing. <laughs>
Still haven't found the sticky tape though. I guess I just have to go buy some new tape. <sighs> but today has not worked out quite to plan. It is now 3.30 in the afternoon. I feel like I've been in here all day long. So I'm going to start on dinner tonight, I think. Uh, my son has his work Christmas drinks after work today. And I want to make sure dinner's ready for him before he needs to leave. And uh, yeah, well, that, that was hard work. I'm feeling really hot now. I think we might need to put the air conditioner on. It's only 25 degrees today, which is much warmer than it has been. But yeah, feeling very warm. So yes, I'm gonna get a start on dinner and I don't know that I'll get much else done today because I feel like I need to have some rest tonight. <laughs> we shall see how that works out. There are still some boxes left to unpack, but many of these are my husband's uh, books, which he can sort through. And those four boxes there are filing cabinet paperwork that I need to go through at some point and get rid of. There's still a little bit left to do in here, but those are jobs for another day. Time to go make some dinner. Go outside, the snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand and watch a choir perform And all the Christmas songs that we love Yeah, all the Christmas songs that we love And in a while we're gonna go inside And drink our chocolate by the fire all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you Making plans, what we're gonna do I feel so blessed that I can be with you Cause God knows that I've been longing for ya I just wanna hold you close You know the stars are shining just for you Let's take a walk and we can follow the moonlight Till we reach a place we can stay Maybe kiss a bit and dream away And in a while we're gonna go inside And drink our chocolate by the fire all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you And drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy Love and so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you Come join in. 
in the air some it has been a day a super super busy day it is now quarter to nine in the evening the house is nice and clean and quiet which is wonderful my oldest son is at his end of year work get together so it'll be interesting to see what time he is ready to come home it's his first proper Christmas party with work so I don't think I've mentioned he um, finished high school this year and he's now working full-time and is starting an apprenticeship in the new year so we're really proud of him he's done a really great job and he's really enjoying what he's doing which is really really important so what I'm going to do now is probably knit a little bit for the evening. I've put in one and a half colours um, on my habitation throw since dinner, which is lovely. It's so nice to be able to work on this project and I really am looking forward to knitting some more on it. I do need to edit yesterday's vlog, so I probably will do that before I go to bed. And that will probably be it. May watch a movie on television. I'm going to try to see if I can talk the family into watching a Christmas movie. I've really been enjoying those and hopefully um, they will join me to do that. It's always nicer to watch it together. I'm just going to finish my French Earl Grey tea that my husband made me. It is delicious but it's getting a little cool now. I cannot believe tomorrow is the 23rd of December. Tomorrow is going to be quite a busy day. I won't be home for quite a lot of it. I have a few appointments I need to take my son to. So we'll get those done, but I'll take you along as I can. But um, I feel like we're really speeding into Christmas now. It's coming so close. I will start wrapping presents probably tomorrow at this rate. I'm feeling a little bit too tired to do that tonight. I feel like I've done a lot of work today. The day didn't turn out at all how I had planned, <laughs> but it was very productive, so I can't complain with that. Okay, so I'm going to sign off for today. I hope that you're having a wonderful day and that your lead up to Christmas has some calm moments in it. And I will check in with you again tomorrow. Something is waiting for me.